as I provided yesterday, I'm extremely grateful for your level of transparency and openness and having the discussion about this outstanding item with the board. I think it contrasts considerably compared to some other discussions that we've had with respect to this project. And I value your approach in valuing the perspective of all the board members. I've shared um, with the board and also with our chairman my thoughts with respect to this 14 million and at the end of the day provided that if I couldn't, if I couldn't stand before taxpayers and um, support our approach towards this that I could not support this agenda item. And while I support our collaborative approach on this, I do believe that there are several documents and there is a history supporting us valuing the significant amount of effort and dollars that the county has put towards development of transportation projects in the Cumberland area with respect to the Braves, which total far beyond 14 million. And what we've done in collaboration with the Braves over recent days is to narrow down our contribution of all the transportation projects that have been contemplated in, in our MOU, our development agreement, the development of regional impact and communication with the board and our website of the Braves development and a legal opinion provided by our attorney and documentation provided by our Department of Transportation um, director. We have contradicted their consideration of projects and those documents consideration of projects in that area by narrowing down our contribution to a very minuscule amount of $3 million. Um, I do believe that because this is a public-private partnership that it's important for us to come together to the table and work together to vet our disagreements However, with the amount of dollars at play, this is beyond just a Board of Commissioners matter and a Braves matter. This is about protecting taxpayer dollars to the tune of $14 million. In a year when we have not funded projects to the tune of tens of thousands and hundreds of thousands at the county, it's very difficult to justify this level of expenditure without the level of consideration that we've get towards smaller amounts and the critical eye we have towards doing things on behalf of the taxpayer. Um, I believe that Cobb County could have successfully negotiated uh, um, with strength, um, our position in that we have contributed more than our fair share of transportation projects in the Cumberland area. I think that um, would this have ever ended up in a court of law, which that would never have been our desire to, but should it have, I think we would be successful in saying that um, there was not necessarily reasonable reliance on some of the documents which have been shared and that the documents which should have the greater weight are those that were integrated into our contract. And so um, 
it is not my pleasure to ever disagree with our board or particularly with our chair who has gone ab above and beyond his um, above and beyond what I've seen on this board prior to him being here of engaging the board in this discussion but I I have grave concern about the statement that we're making here and our ability to leverage other decision making based off of our decision here today. Thank you for your eloquent comments, Commissioner Cupid. 